Hi everyone, so this is a little book I ended up making with all the new Dina Wakeley bits and pieces. The base of the book is made using the new Collage Spikes collection. This is Collage Spikes Collection 3. Um, so the double sided 4x6 sheets. Um, I use Collage Collection 1 for this little book. Just fold them up to make this little junk journal. So it's got all sorts of different bits and pieces in here because I got carried away. Um, I actually used the the back of the journal is the cardboard from the back of this because it's really nice and solid. So I could stick the ribbon in. And I've just filled it with all sorts of different goodies. So I started off with the collage um, background and then I've added paint over top and stenciling mic making masking um i've cut um, leftover bits and used those to collage over the top you can see on this page it's mostly the background i've just added in a little bit of washi um one of the paper dolls um a little bit of the new crown from the new transparencies so there's three new transparency set one with faces which i've uh, use lots of <laughs> um one with lots of frames and so on in it and then this circle one which is where the crowns have come from so you'll see lots of different bits and pieces you go through and this is just a bit of a i suppose all, um all the old masks old stamps new collage um uh transparencies the new um find it um, stencils from the last release again this page in the background is pretty much as is I haven't done much to it apart from stick the paper doll over it whereas this one I've done some of the mask or uh, stenciling over top cut out some bits of um, use the stencil to cut out some little collage fodder which you can see on this page too put some stenciling in the background Again, this one's pretty much as is with just um, a doll added over the top. This one as well, just a simple frame on it and one of the um, figures from the transparency set. This one has most of the background. I used colours to do a little bit of splatter on the background and then added in some of the um, circular transparencies. This one is a large transparency that I've just cut and put over the background. So again, really, really simple way to fill up your pages really quickly. Same with this one. All I've done in here is just add in a little transparency over here, a little bit of stenciling and some collage at the top, which is the offcuts from doing cutting these out. So nothing went to waste. This page, again, just a little thing here, a little crown. Popped on a stamp here, used my collage, the leftovers from cutting out those leaves. You'll see those pop up quite a few places. I love this little girl and that's my favourite washi tape from Dina as well. The little crown on her head. Again, those little frames, just changing it up by putting little white dots in it. So really easy to change over. And at the end of the book, again, you can see my offcuts to make little borders big transparency face that I've glued down. Um, this book has been bound using the tab binding, um, which I know Dina has got a um, video on how to do as well. Really, really simple binding. I've got a few videos on my channel to do it and I will pop how I made this book together on the beginning, but it doesn't show you how to decorate it. But I'm pretty sure you can do that yourself. There's... Um, it can be as simple or as complex as you fancy, but it's just a, such a really fun little book to pop together. So thank you for watching. Until next time, bye for now.